Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoy. If you are watching this on YouTube, thumb up or subscribe. This is the real map. GTA map. Doubt versus Mihai. Let's go, baby. And we are starting. We are starting. Let's go. Doubt. The Lord versus Mihai. A little bit faster speed in darkest, but then let's focus. Malians versus Berbers. Okay. I'm surprised about that, but uh, hmm. Okay, okay. But guys, I'm gonna go serious mode activated. I want to cast out properly. Well, I, I'm casting all the series properly, but you know, no joking. Okay. Blue, doubt. Let's go and check his, uh, his position. We have deers close to the TC. Look at the boar as well. I'm not a fan to make the TC super close to the water, but this case is a lake. So it should have a big problem here. You know? While yellow... Oof. Look at this. With yellow berries in front. Who is this? Sunny. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. By the way, I have also the, the, the one with Avatar. Ha! I have everything, guys. I have Batman. I have Spider-Man. I have many things. I have also... I have also something related with, with the game. With the helmet. You know, I have everything as you can see. I'm ready to make any casting, you know? Any casting, amigos. I have doubt too. Okay, let's focus now. Look at the dog here. Okay. Taking yellow. You can see how the population is almost the same. The build order, you, you are learning that you have... You go with five, six villages on wood. I mean, because you need to you need to spam fishing ships, you know? So obviously, it's not like in the normal maps that you go for food first, then you put four villages on wood. The, the village distribution is completely different on Nomad. I'm not going too deep into that, but uh, I believe that you know about that already. But if you are new in the channel, or in the game and you want to know a little bit more details about uh, what is better or worst, you know, and how to play, just ask. You know, if I see the chat, I will try to make the explanation. And if I cannot because I'm following the action, there is someone in the chat that is gonna is gonna tell you 100%, you know? So don't be shy, guys. Just interact. The channel, the viewers in the channel are not that bad, guys. They are pretty nice sometimes. <laughs> Okay, now one, two villages on goal. Yes, he's gonna go for the goal and out. He's not going up yet. While yellow is going up quite fast. Twenty-two population. It really depends how you play. In theory, Malians is better overall, but if you win the water battle and then you are able to achieve castles in a better position than Malians, tell me how you stop. Berbers dropping a castle and going camel arches, for example. Not gonna be easy, you know? Not really gonna be easy. But let's see. He has 11 fishing ships. Five! So, uh oh. Look at that. But that's the problem. He has so many, but one minute, 10 seconds, and now he needs to move everything. Doing another dog. So he's doing three dogs, and this fish is in danger. Is really really in danger. Gonna go to the to this area. I like it. Because now he has moved pretty much. Let's go normal. He has moved the, the most of them and he leaves the two fishing ships here. Very smart play. What? Stone walls. Oh my goodness. Stone walls. Ay ay ay. Okay. Azul. Okay. It's gonna what? What? I mean, it's a smart play, actually. If you check a stone wall, then a stone wall too. He's fully wall. Yeah. This is very, very smart play by Yellow, honestly. Look at this. I mean, I don't like it, but he's very smart. Absolutely. He's fully wall. What the hell? Obviously. He need to take the water, 
Otherwise, all these walls not gonna help. I mean, they will help, but they're not gonna do too much. Because if you lose the water now, Doubt can transport. He can transport villages. So, I mean, it's nice, but okay, Mikhail is here. That's very nice. Very, very nice. But he has double dog. Need to kill. There's a villa he can repair. He's going to repair all the time. And now there's two fire galleys. Just move, man. Move! Well, I don't get it, man. I mean, can you explain me in what other spot he was fighting? Because I don't know. Yeah, now, I mean, all these small details is what is makes the difference, you know? Like... The multitasking. You can see Doc in the south, Doc on the left. He's not really reacting fast. And Doubt has already the same units. Well, a little bit less, but four villages more. And great economy. Yeah, he's fully walled. Stone walls. But... He's gonna be behind in the timing for sure. Or he should be. He has 11 fishing ships. Five. Seven fishing ships. Okay. So one dog, two dogs, good fish. Now it's moving back with the three galleys. Yeah, he's micro better, man. He's micro much better. Much better. 6 3 now, the KD. Need to be careful. Yes. And this dog, he, I mean, he's doing galleys here, but he's he's just wasting units. It's definitely wasting units. Okay. Well, he's wall now. Economy, as you can see, three villages more. Distribution, 17 on wood, 10 on food, 9 on gold. Resources, as you can see, blue about to go up. He's doing blast with a market. He can buy resources and go up. Yeah, he's doing that. Balancing his economy, amigos. And there you go. He's going to Castle Age with a very smooth play. Honestly, I mean, if Mihai is a 2.2k, Doubt should be, in this kind of maps, massive favorite against many players. With the novelist and the experience he has, honestly, only the top, top, top should really have a chance against Doubt. In my opinion, I don't know what you think, but that should be one of the favorites in this tournament for sure. Yeah. Don't you think, guys? I mean, this is what I think. With the speeds that would have, he should really be one of the favorites of the tournaments for sure. Yeah. Okay. He has now nine villages on goal. Okay. Yeah, I mean, no, doubt is not always favorite, you know. But. Um, <clears throat> You know that it's not always uh, easy to to execute the strategy. Yellow is up already. It's the same village, 44-44. But the timing is important here. It's a two minutes advantage. But he's a stone wall. So what is he planning to do now? A monastery. And not going to attack. Not going to transport. He didn't make a dog. That's why he's doing outpost. Yeah, he's trying to secure that one. Also, you know, the good thing with this is that Mihai could raid if he was doing the army, you know? Because doubt is open. Like, he can raid. But he has nine villages on stone. I think he will have the resources to make a castle. And then a castle and camel arches can be painful here. Because you can raid. And raiding can create a lot of chaos and is in the kind of those situations that doubt doesn't feel as comfortable. But not only doubt, in general, all the players. 
getting raided is is definitely not what you want. Anyway, four valleys more now five because he has the advantage in the timing and will need to attack quick. He don't have the resources. I think he should buy a hand of stone because you don't want to wait till you are gathering the six hundred. Ah. Oh. Why a tone center? Oh my goodness. Why a tone center? A two extra tone center. It's okay. His booming is not going aggressive. Then Dowd will have bigger advantage. Because he's already with two TCs. And booming before him. Yeah, he's doing two TCs right away. But why you put the nine villains on stone and also the mine the stone mine upgrade? Maybe he still wants to make the castle, but after having the three TCs up. I believe so. Okay. I think the rule is that the most used civilization for the previous round cannot be used in the next. I believe that's why nobody is using Spanish. Spanish was used the most, so now Spanish cannot be picked. Is correct? You have to explain me the rules, guys, because I think that's the rule. Yeah. Not gonna lie. I didn't read all the rules. So, that's why Spanish is not there, amigos. Okay. He's doing a third tone center. The castle is already there. Menstradamus is still on point. So... Mangonel, he has the castle, this is wall, and the camel is he will need to raid. He's nine villains behind. Okay. But three TCs, so he should be fine. Pretty much. Malians has been used today a lot. So I believe they will be banned for the next round as well. You're right. Okay. Big bada boom here. Look at the village difference, guys. Village difference is almost nothing now. He's still with a lot more army, yes, but this navy. And navy is become useless. It's really become useless. Those villages, those fishing ships are not even effective anymore. Yeah, he's gonna move. I will stay there. J just keep it. Why you wanna go there? You're gonna lose them with the galleys. Okay, okay, that was good. It was lucky. And he's doing camel archers. Do more and more. Village difference is almost nothing. Seven, and both players with a with a very good boom need to make more farms for sure. Overbooming. Why four TCs? You have 12 on foot, almost no farmers. Explain me why four tone center. I don't understand. I really believe three TCs is more than enough at this point. You can just make more camel arches. I will make university and ballistic if needed instead of the four tone center. I think it's a mistake. You know, you're gonna have the TCs idle uh, from now on. He won't have food. He won't have food to keep producing the layers. So I don't get it why four TCs, really. Is it's a random tone center. Seriously. Anyway, now Doubt is the one who is walling. He has camel arches, but not using them. I don't get it, this gameplay. You know? And even less against Doubt. You don't want to play for the late game against Doubt, one of the best players in the world. When the game go longer, man. He's very strong. Really, really strong with the micro. So raid a little, but he's not doing. He's doing heavy blow. He does have Bozo. Okay, no will borrow for any of the players. And as you can see, Doubt with three TCs is increasing the boom. It's also true that he's going to lose all the fish here. Okay, 72 villages, 80 villages. All right. And how is the tone centers here? One, two, three. And now idle. And idle again. 
Yeah, just two TC's active. That's why the idle TC just increase, increase, and increase. Ah, yeah, yeah. It's now doing fletching. No bozo, though. And look at the economy for doubt. As we expected. Much better. Yeah, might rate a little bit, but won't do too much. It's doing guild dance also with 14 fishing ships. Come on. Thank you for the content, mem, mem, love, mem, jam, mem, sub, dot, love. Thank you, man. Helios Nova Spell, thank you so much. Memflix is always here. Remember that we are getting closer and closer to a thousand days in a row. It's a crazy mark. But well, we're getting there. Ooh. It's no botkin. Nah, this game is over. I'm sorry to say I want to hype you because the population is is no it, the population is a big difference. So I like this is happening. Daudu is with three TCs, and his boom is much better than his opponent with four. Because with four tone centers, he's not producing with all them at all. Yeah. It's about the balance, man. And three TCs was very, 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 very good. He has now a few monks, two mangonels, and doubt it is on the way to Imperial. On the way to Imperial. Oh my goodness. I mean, but this is normal. <clears throat> Sorry, just think about this. Yellow has reached castle. It's later. Then he was mining a lot of stone. Instead of they made a castle right away, he did two TCs when Daud was already with the town centers. So obviously his boom is going to be ahead. And then he made the castle and it start... Well, the, the castle idea is great, but a Daud castle can happen. No, because he's going to disturb. I like that. Monk down. Camel archers, the Mangonel, he's gonna go with villages, okay. It's no ballistic, gonna lose another village, let's go. He convert one, now he's gonna take this one or not? Got it, losing another village, I think it's gonna be a doubt castle. Or not. Ooh, he's not even moving the village, I, I, I micro man. He's microing or not? Not really. Well, those camels are going down. Those camels are... Oh my goodness. Bada boom. Doubt is sick. Sick of the micro, man. Are you kidding me, man? Another one. How many villages is killing? So many. Now he's going to take the micro. Okay, at the end he's going to make this castle. But check the resources. Check the resources. My music is medieval total war music. Okay. But don't think the mod is on, on Steam. Because I got this mod. Because I got the, the, the songs from Bubli. And then transported it into a customized mod with those, with those songs from Bubli. You can take the music on Bubli and then get into, into the DE. Yeah. Anyway. Look at the economy, guys. His economy is insane. He can go up to Imperial again. It's true that Yellow is about to go up. 111 villages, okay. But why he's wasting units there? Okay, maybe it's not wasted. Uh, it's okay. Look at that echo, man. It's sick. It's not on the way to Imperial. He still have 111 villages. It's good, but this is a trap already. A trap already doing the job and taking this castle. You don't want that. The score difference is 1,000. It's not that that is definitive, but it looks very solid. And those camel archers now trying to kill. No ballistic, though. No ballistic, no bloodlines, no armor, no thumbprint, no nothing. Just the plus two attack. Yeah, those camel archers are very strong. Infantry? What? Infantry upgrade with Berbers? What is he planning, man? Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know. No wheelbarrow, by the way. No wheelbarrow when you have this amount of farms. That's the looks too good. And I wonder what he's planning to do. He's gonna go champions? Maybe? Pikes? He's gonna go pikes with, with Berbers? That would be unbelievable. But he's doing barracks, guys. 
He's doing barracks. He's doing Obamas. He lost this castle here. He's gonna lose the other castle and... Well, it's all about the timing. Pikes, man. Boom into Pikes. Crazy. Crazy. Need houses. Mm, houses. He's housed forever, guys. Well, when you know that, I mean, when you are doing pikemans with Berberus against Malians, you know that you are dead. Pretty much. He's doing now ballistic. Those are heavy camels, plus four. And if he's migrating with, with those upgrades and without bloodlines, the camels are going to eat everything. But you need to send all those. He's trying to make pikes, but he can't. He still was housed for a little bit. He's trying to micro properly here. He still have a decent population, but the score lead is massive for a good reason. Okay. He took those, and now he's doing more pikes. Now he's coming with more camels. Those Malian camels could have Parimba, but he doesn't have. He's doing champion. Well, men at arms. He's going for the... Infantry line, well, doubt here is just dominating. Look at the score. Like, it's a lot about the timing. The villain is different, you see only 16, but doesn't matter. You just close your eyes and think that Taut has doubled the KD and uh, a brutal economy lead with only three tone centers. Sick macro, man. 45 farmers, 40 season wood. Now he's doing the long swords. Arbred, he can come with champions and then finish, but this is over already. He should resign and go for game number two. Yeah, doubt with the domination. Doubt with the real domination. Taking now Villiers. I mean, it's so smooth gameplay here by Doubt, really. With the three TCs, not over booming, doing a great boom actually. Yeah, he's gonna lose those those traps probably. But at least he's gonna kill the castle. Need another shot. Oh! Uh, no, he's gonna save it. Yeah. He's saving because he repaired that one. Okay. But those camels are useless there. Just bring it here and go for the castle. Nice two traps. That castle is going to go down. GG. GG Doubt playing amazing the first game, really good. Mihai did a bad strategy in my opinion, he didn't play the greatest, like he was uh, with the stone walls that was nice, but uh, it was two minutes castle this time, but those two minutes give Doubt like 10 villages lead and two TCs extra. Then Mihai tried to catch up and make the TC, so he will never catch up. And when he do the castle, he only make it slow down himself more, and he can't push anymore. So in my opinion, he needed a castle right away and a siege war shop. Try to, to, to raid, make some damage, and then when you see that you do some damage, go for more economy. Otherwise, happen what happened. The doubt, total domination. Vamos, game number two is gonna be domination. Yeah. Okay, Doubt Persians, Mihai, Mihai Indians. Okay. Well, a lot of people is Doubt fan. We, we know that, right? A lot of people is Doubt fan. <clears throat> Persians and Indians, civilization that we have been watching uh, pretty often, and makes sense. They are strong. Doubt with the Lumber Camp right away, and a dog right away, too. Well, Doubt need a house instead of the dock. Yes, and he's doing the house. Remember that this map is kind of annoying because... Oh, taking a buffalo. You need more villages on wood. I don't know if this is a good build order for, for, for green. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
all villages on on food. Only one village on wood. Then he's gonna try something. I think he's not gonna fish. Okay, this is what he's going to do then. He's not gonna fish in his own base. He's gonna try to go look at this mining goal already. He's gonna go incredibly fast and gonna try to sneak a dog here and dominate from there. Wow! Look at the time up! Look at the time up by me high. This is a, a pro strategy. Holy shit! Five minutes up, 30, 15 population up, six, seven minutes. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay, and now, Doc, what the hell? It's, it's, it's awesome here. Okay, but don't lose a scout. No loom? No, no, he has a loom. And now he's gonna make the Doc. Super fast. Definitely whole map, you know? He has practice, and that's amazing. Amazing strategy by Green. Amazing strategy by Green. Seriously. Oh, he's it now. Okay. And he's doing galleys. Yes. Galleys, because they kill faster. But he need a second dog. In my opinion, at least. He need a second dog. Problem? Eight, eight villages, eight population difference. He has no fish on his own. The problem is that you are at the limit with their resources. And now if he's doing the fire galleys, he's just gonna dominate. Taking with the scout. Really? Killing villages here? Ah, oh, come on. No, man. No, kill the fish, man. Ay, ay, ay. He's doing now a fire galley. Okay. Well, it's a good try. But... Well, he has a fire galley. Okay. And repairing. Poof. The micro has to be immense. Insane, as you can see. Doing another house. Oh my goodness. He's repairing now. Okay. Well, if he micro properly. He need to kill the fish. Otherwise, he's dead already. He's still five villages behind. But the, the fish is not working that smooth. 24 villages, 25. It's almost the same. It's at the limit. And now, Blue want to make a dog here. Interesting. Please. Do you need to see it? Oh, 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 Okay, but doubt also Titanic, because he didn't walk himself. What? Quick wall, man! I, I follow doubt. I follow doubt. Okay, nice. And here. Obviously, he took everything now. Doing now the RT range. He tried a crazy strategy. It's not working. He's now going the barrack. Searching that villager. Need to make more fish or not? Yeah, he's fully wall. Yeah, that mill is great. He can take surface too. Let's see. Yeah, some archers. The dog is bye-bye. But guys, look at the fish he has. 12 fishing ships, man. Whoa. Okay, not bad economy. Well, he's doing more galleys now. That's useless. You need the botkin. That he has the... No, no, no. He need to make a galley now. Fire galley, he's fine. But guys, he has no fish. He need to fish. The problem for... For Mihai that he has no fish. It's 12 villages different. One fishing ship, 12. That's it. But the arches are here. And now... Oh, by the way. Normal speed. Sorry, guys. I forgot to put normal speed. Now the arch is coming here. It was that fast. He's, he's time up. that I forgot to put normal speed. Yeah. He needed to kill the transport. But the thing is, you go that early and then you don't kill anything. That's... That's terrible. Like, seriously. I love the time up he did, but... Psst. Fletching, no double attacks. 
no more fire galleys, so yeah, he's up to castle is man. You see, well, I mean, Mihai's strategy was very nice in theory, but it didn't work. Check the KD, guys. Mihai didn't kill anything. Now he's killing some villager. Let's go. He's gonna kill it. He has fletching, so maybe. Go, go, go. Ay, ay, ay. What? <laughs> the quick walls, man. By the Lord. Yeah, now kill that villager, please. Got it. There you go. <laughs> quick world, man. <laughs> it's still, it's still idle, those villages. I love it, man. He's a legend, man. He's a legend. I mean... Uh, I mean, all people like Doubt, he can't make these kind of things, you know? If he was 25 like me, he could do that quick world. But, you know, this is not possible at his age, you know? <sighs> okay, this guy is gonna take the arches now. And now, all these galleys to take this dog, and he has no food at all. His castle is now... It's just impossible. It's just impossible. He has one on foot. He will never go castleage. He should do fishing ships. Or I don't know what he should do, but something. A few arches and now doubt can do whatever. He's with knights. To clean uh, anything that is here. Yeah, well, he keeps sending a few archers. And with the knight, yeah, look at his economy. Still doesn't have a lot of wood, but the knight is coming. <laughs> he deleted, and now the knight will take over. The knight has plus one, so he's a node. He has a scout as well. He's gonna clean everything. Buy the food, man. Okay, look at those resources. He's trying. Village is different. He's 40, he's 49. So it's not that much. But obviously his opponent is in Castellate. So when he reached Castellate Green, if he is gonna get there, poof! It's gonna be insane difference. It's true that now he's fishing. <laughs> Look at the balance. He's trying to 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 buy the way to go up. Second town center. Spear and you need to raid. Okay. He's gonna go up or not? Guys, no food, man. Look at this. No food. He has no food, amigo. He's idle TC. No resources to go up. That's crazy. And since Doubt is also buying food, he needs more and more resources to buy. Look at this. Yeah. Zero resources. It's still idle TC for me. Hi. And unable to go up. This is his foot. And those villains, those fish idle. Now he's up. But the difference now, it should be massive. Okay, but relocate those. Okay, he did it. There's more knights coming. And what is uh, he planning now to do? You need farmers, man. At least few farmers here and there. Would be good. This is open, by the way. Still the fees is... Uh... Still the fees is... Not what it is. Okay. Oh, look at the lambrican. He put here to be safe. Well, population is not a massive difference, but the timing is the problem here. Doubt is gonna go with some siege. He has a second town center. This is still very annoying. Still moving villages. Okay. Taking the relics already, Doubt. Well, he's gonna try Cav Arches, I believe. He has no food to anything else. Yeah. He's gonna go Cav Arches. And let's see, because with Cav Arches, you can raid here. As... The map is quite exposed. Indian Cav Archers. With zero food. 
Yeah, well, let's see. The problem is that again that the the the, the economy difference is is brutal, man. It's really brutal. LTC now doing the valley is okay. He will need ballistic for sure. And now the knights are going home. Another TC. He has four archer ranges because he got another forward. Okay. He could mass. But he should attack. I mean, if he's not being aggressive now, it's gonna happen more or less the same that in the previous game. He need to go now all in. Um, Cab Arches, University with Ballistic, I like that. And probably even a Siege Workshop at some point, because Doubt has six knights and not doing more. Okay, time to raid. Time to raid. You can see your opponent is taking the, the outpost. Yeah, and Doubt is taking the third relic already. Okay, he's gonna be able to deny that, TC. Yeah, he's in time. No bloodlines, no ballistic, but village will go. Take the monk first. Take the monk first. Take the damn monk. Take the damn monk. Take the damn monk. <laughs> My goodness, man. And he converted two cab arches, man. What the hell? Take the damn monk. Yeah, well, what he's doing is what he has to do, but. You need to kill the monk. My darling you, thank you for the prime, man. Okay. He's just stonewalling somehow. Now the Cavarges are in, he's gonna make some raiding, Ballistic is very dangerous. He don't have any economy upgrades, but you don't need upgrades anymore, you need to attack. He's 20 villages behind, but if he's able to mass a lot of Cavarges, then maybe he can do something. The problem is that his opponent got Camels and Knights, you know? So he has a good counter. If he micro, because if he's not micro in now doubt, we'll have the problems too. Parsa! What's up, amigo? Hola, Parza. Okay. Hello there. Okay. Let's see now those cap arches. He need to be careful and go back a little. Okay. Yes, he's going. It's massing more and more, but no bloodless. Okay, bloodless is on the way. He's gonna take more. Yes. Okay. Yeah, he's, he's doing a good job. I mean, be careful with the cap archers because if he mass a good amount of cap archers, he can do the job. And Doubt right now has no army. We have seen many times. Ooh, a castle. A Doubt castle. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. But he's not killing. Okay, well. He didn't kill the monk. He didn't kill the villagers. He let that castle up. I don't understand, man. He could have been at least kill five, six villagers. I don't know. Yeah, he's not killing the important units. The camels got plus two. That's good. No bloodlines. Just look how fast they die. Even with the plus two, the camels used to get destroyed. But he should spam more cab arches, if you ask me. <clears throat> Please kill the monks. But the fuck? What the fuck? I mean, sorry guys, but he's not killing any monk. He passed with the monk. He don't want to kill the monks or what? He's converting all the units, man. All the time. Okay, now killing the villagers. Another villager, he has killed more Echo. But Doubt Boom is insane at the moment. Really insane. You know what I'm missing? That he's going forward, man. Now doing barracks, but look at the economy. 
I think he, he should have gone more cab archers and a siege board shop in this area and attack. I know it's difficult. And against Persian TC, even harder. It's more HP, those stone centers, but now he has a crazy economy. I hand the 17 villages. And it's so impossible to to counter. That's why he's adding the barracks to make pikes. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Coming to the TC. He cannot. Need to go back. And this area is all full of stone walls. Wow. Danny Mayan is doing the pikes, but doubt. He's <laughs> up to Imperial, man. He's on the way to Imperial, man. Such a boomer boy. He didn't even delete the main TC. I don't know if he did villains with this. He's up to Imperial with this one. Good. And feast traps even. Probably he did real nets and everything. He's a new subscriber? Oh my goodness. Thank you, AGG345. Awesome. Really, really awesome. Okay. By the way, maybe I will check the... Uh, since now we have a lot of people that want to watch the tournament. Maybe after this series I will cast even more. Because there is more series. Maybe I cast Winchester, for example. We'll see. We will analyze after this series, okay? He has four relics. Ooh, castle on top of that hill. But it's crazy, guys, how these players... I mean, Mihai is 2.2k. 2... 0.2k and oh, well yeah. insane oh my goodness mr domes thank you man okay has to be careful i mean i was about to say that these players like dao that well and some others i don't want to say names but you you can think of a few of those mihai is 2.2k and with some couple of decisions better, it looks so strong, man. And makes the other look well, a normal sub. player, you know? A normal player. Is man using a filter? That's disrespectful, man. I mean, because I lose 25, you are asking if I'm using a filter? It's disrespectful, man. Seriously, man. I just got operated, man. Seriously. <sighs> My goodness, man. Castle on top of that hill on this side, but he's never going to go army, man. He's never going to go up. It's impossible, you know? Anyway, Cavaliers, Conscription. <laughs> he's using a filter to look older, exactly. <clears throat> because I am Memba Min Button. Oh, now he's going. And those are Cavaliers. The game is over. It's 2,000 score difference, so please be high. It was a good try, but... ECG, man. <clears throat> ECG, man. Now he's Cavaliers. He's gonna be plus four. Yeah, he got some pikes. You don't even need it. Don't take the fight. Just go for the traps and that's it. Doubt is almost 200 pop. Yeah, he got two castles, one in this area, well protected, the other on the left, and he's a stone wall. I don't know what Mihai is waiting for. His population is good, I agree. He's doing rams, because he wants to spam pikes. Okay. Paladin upgrade, guys. Paladin upgrade, oh boy. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Paladin upgrade, guys. Yeah, for those people that just joined, uh, Mihai tried an, an incredible strategy. He won't have 15 population. He was up. He was up seven minutes and uh, was trying to sneak here, but he couldn't do the damage. And then from there, doubt uh, just uh, dominated, you know. He's still doing more and more army. But doubt just need to wait for the Paladins. And the Paladins will take over. Yeah, doubt will take over, man.
I'm just waiting for the Paladin upgrade. It's a little bit weird that the player is not giving up, but he's trying to put a lot of pikes and now Paladins. So imagine what is going to happen with that army. It's going to disappear. That army is just going to disappear. Yeah, yeah, man. It's, it's too strong. <laughs> it's really too strong. 2 zero, guys. 2 zero. Military. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm losing my voice already. I'm casting a lot and then I'm losing my voice. Oh, look at the economy, man. Look at the economy. Look at the food. Holy shit. And the goal. It, it's double, man. It's double. It's really double. More than double the food. Mm, this is double the goal, pretty much. It's crazy. Game number three. Go, go, go. And... Well, the colors are kind of... Awkward, blue and teal. I will make him uh, looks red, which is easy. Mihai as a red, doubt as a blue. Is this in the range? Lithuanians and Mongols? I think it's in the range, right? Well, Mongols is great with all the hand. Lithuanians is good because it's a good civilization, but it's not in the range. It's not in the range. I think with the mods I have, it's not in the range, man. <laughs> Look at this. One tile. One tile is not in the range. Yeah, well, that's why I put the, the normal build. You see the, the mod and it's not in the range. That's crazy. Okay. Well, he's, he's trying to lame a little. Well, the Mongols is great here. Uh, let's see what he's going to do. Already with the Lumber Camp. Now he's going to send Village to make a Lumber Camp too. And this map... Mm. Well, I prefer Mongols for the start. For the later game, I believe the Lithuanians. But what is Mihai going to try here? I don't know. We'll see what he's gonna try, amigos. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> the save uh, the bold was was a little bit of a joke, guys. It was a funny a funny casting with uh, Mr. Capoch. Okay, he's doing the dog here, and. Uh, he has five bullets on wood. Thank you guys for the follow. Really appreciate it. Remember that tomorrow we continue. You all know probably. If not, I will remind you that this is hosted by Dave Anti 90 You know, sponsor by Microsoft, $25,000 prize pool. And we are doing these recorded games every weekend at 15 GMT. Okay? 15 GMT. And the grand final that, if I'm not wrong, is going to be 6 February. The grand final is live. Okay? Live. Six fillets on wood. And after this series, we might check... Well, no, I'm not going to check yet the brackets in case that I decide to cast more series. He's doing a dog now. That dog is quite late. Look at... This is... I mean, look at the population. This is ridiculous. Mihai is up super quick, but doubt... With only one minute, it's six population more. So, is this fast speed worthy? This fast up worthy? Mm, I'm not so sure. It looks similar to the previous game. And if he's not doing the damage now, he's behind already. Like a lot. Three fishing ships, okay. Well, not like a lot, but... Uh, yeah, he's going galleys. That's okay. But he's gonna have fire galleys in time, probably. I don't know. Okay. Did someone cast Adol versus T90? Yes, I did. I cast it. Do you remember, guys, that if you miss something, I will upload on YouTube everything, so... 
you might be able to watch on YouTube as well. Okay. It's gonna make some more Merc. Uh, it's carry, and you can buy there. Below the stream, all the information, Mr. Scary. I'm terrible with the sellout. I never sell out anything, but all the information is below the stream, okay? Okay. Well, he's there with the galleys, and as I told you, he's not going around. If he just pay attention, I think he should wait, but he's doing more. One galley, one demo, yeah. Resources at the limit now for Mihai. Where is the galleys? He's not going, man. Wow. Okay. Well, in long run, the galleys are very solid. If you mass them, if you micro properly, you might be able to dominate. He's doing a demolition. The demolition rap will help a lot. But he still didn't take anything. So, Daud is still six villages ahead. Is three villages more? What the hell? And the three fishing ships. Holy moly, man. Don't understand why three villages more. Well, Mihai has been more and more idle time. Oh my goodness. Look at the idle time and he has the food. This, well, he's doing on purpose just to have fletching. Okay, that makes sense. But it's still, yeah, bigger and bigger difference, as you can see. Bigger and bigger difference. Oh, that was a demo. And that demo, ooh. Now the demo is not effective because if you micro properly, the galleys will take over, as you can see. Sorry. Yeah, look. With some good micro, now Doubt will have problems. Doubt, no navy at all. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The galley is just dominating this situation. So, what Doubt need to do now? Need to be a stubborn and keep on water? Third dock. Fire galley and it started to make galleys as well. Okay. But I don't know if he's gonna be able to catch up. Well, actually, it's only one, one galley difference. Oof. No, no, no. Need to go away. Oh my goodness. This noble listed that way he can go. Then Kali, he's gonna take the Valir. Yeah, he got it. But for now, he just want to mass more galleys. Ah, too much water in this, in these maps. Come on, man. I think it's too much water in my, for my taste. Seriously. The best battles are on the land. Come on. Oh, oh, be careful there. Mr. Subsero, love you, man. Okay, thank you, man. <laughs> At least someone loved me. Say to my wife the other day, why you never tell me that you love me, Marta? And she look at me and tell me, too many years together. <laughs> Harsh but true, man. <laughs> disaster, man. Disaster. Real disaster. Okay, let's see the galleys. It's not that many, only 14 years, man. What the hell? Yeah, man. Okay, let's see. He's gonna take this dock. Uh, it's coming from behind. Ah. Still so many water. And they're fighting guys for no for no fish. You know, L like they have a lot of galleys. And they're fighting for no fish. Here's the galleys. He's gonna take maybe a villager now. Okay. Now taking a galley. And Daud is at the end massing more and more. So now he's catching up the numbers. And with a good micro, he might take over. We will see. <laughs> you can get married at 11 in Spain. You are trollers, man. 
Oh well, Spain is so advanced, guys. We are super modern. Super, super modern. Anyway, oh, 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 be careful there. Yeah, he has so many galleys. The fire galley is not gonna help. Let's see the battle. Need to go now. He's trying to micro. Those fire galleys might do the job. Yes, keep putting them in front like a shield. Trying to out micro these, but it's not really working because he needs more galleys and he's coming. Honestly, at least the the uh, the micro galley rush is much better than the fire galleys. You know, fire galleys with the two ranges, you know, it's disgusting. And we can see if those guys are dancing. He's doing another dog. But Mihai, bit the resources. Yeah. To the market and galley down in the hell. Doubt is still three villains more. Mihai is still gathering and having idle TC. Ooh. Yeah, well, he's taking the fire galleys, but he's killing galleys. So be careful. Doubt is not so behind. He has 14 galleys, 17. He's three only. But obviously at these numbers, it's difficult. And with those resources, he's on the way to Castle Age. Right now, four dogs. And then you check this map and you think about... Man, this map is just full galley like it was Baltic, like it was uh, Islands. It's a pity, man. But... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Now now he's going to take all the Navy. If it is mine, and now take all the Navy. Oh, 15 galleys, 18. If it doubt go, he's killing all. He has three dogs, doubt four. So now he's going to go up to Castellate and blue. Doubt will kill everything. Yeah, red will be in Castellate with no Navy. Look at this disaster. Well, you see where the galleys are going? They are going here. Well, it's not about the micro, it's about the numbers. He added a 4 TC, he's spamming, now he's doing fishing ships. Yes, but Daud will need to make an insta market, buy resources and go up as soon as possible. But now, what is Red going to do? Now he's doing fire galleys against this amount of no, uh, of galleys? You kidding me, man? You kidding me? Well, population 64, 41. Yeah, well, now you just need to buy resources. Why not go in army on land and just kill everything, man? Don't get it. Why keep on water? I don't understand this. Look at Doubt. He sell his soul to go up. <laughs> He's just selling everything, man. Yeah, there you go. He's up. 1,000 food now. Sell some food, man. Doing a lumber camp, and he's up to Castle Age. War galley upgrade without galleys. This is crazy. Oh, 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 oh. It's so many fire galleys. You need to be careful. Need to get all together. If you have all together, you can still kill those galleys. Yeah. Let's see. As you can see, killing one. Two. Now, the other. No, no. He doesn't have the numbers, man. Need to go back. It's impossible. Really, really impossible. Look at the numbers. Look at the villains difference. Doubt 53. He has 47 villains, 40, 43, and now six fishing ships. And killing more ga galleys. More fire galleys. He's just useless. I don't think that he can catch up. Well, that's truth. That's truth if you don't have Navy. But that's why they need the TC here. Do you really need the Tone Center here? Maybe what you have to do is to make the TC in this area directly. But it's also true that in the start, all the hand is there. So it's a tricky map. I mean, the map is looks land, but then it's, it's so much water because in those shallows, yeah, as you mentioned, if you don't have uh, navy, you can't make villages, and then you are dead. So that's why this map is massive on water. Massive on water. And now Wargale upgrade, Botkin, 
And with this amount of navy he has, there's no chance for red. Not on water. So he will need another TC and ignore that town center. Yeah, well, he will have the upgrade. He has the botkin now. In 10 seconds, the, the war galley upgrade. Now he's moving all the villiers. He can send even more galleys here. No, man, what are you doing now? Stop overconfidence, man. Yeah, well, he's killing all, not taking anything. He could do ballistic, he could do anything he want. He sell the stone, Bolt has no stone. So, I mean, if Red is now doing Kyrinin, he has five navy, man. Five, four galleys, 26 galleys. It's GG, guys. It's completely GG. Look at the score. And that didn't start. Uh, didn't start good, you know? But decisions, guys. Decisions. It's what matters. Oh, a knight finally took a couple of villages and the goal is in the hell. Okay. But with the galleys, you kill all. That's the biggest problem. There's no ballistic, but... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Focus. Focus, Mr. Doubt. It's true that those, those knights made some damage. Still have six villages on goal. I don't know where. Need to check. Here it is, so he's okay. And still, there is no, no navy at all. He is coming to make what? A lumber camp here. All right. But look at red economy, guys. Almost no food. No stone to make extra TCs. And idle. Three villains idle. Just go now. Yeah, imagine ballistic. Also no resources here. Hey, the, the score difference is just brutal now. It's really brutal. He has a second tone center. He's doing another lumber camp. He could buy a stone. He did it. And now buy a stone to make another TC where he's gonna make it. Where he's gonna make it? Maybe here? Well, wood and gold protected. Or where he's gonna do it? I don't know. Ooh, he's going to convert few. Few fire galleys. He converted one and killing them, the others. Yeah, I mean, he bought it 100 stone, but I don't know for what. He's not using and he's not going to use because doubt made a total domination. Total domination, amigos. Oh, baby. Doubt did the job, amigos. Doubt did the job and wrecked, wrecked his opponent. Pretty sick. Pretty, pretty sick with the economy. 3-0. Thumb up on YouTube, amigos.